Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World Dominion anal well, anal analysis uh, image stuff. Today we are going to be looking at a brand new image shown on the Empire magazine uh, or Empire website um, which shows, uh, here it is, so it shows Chris Pratt uh, on a motorbike in a Malta uh, alleyway, it looks like, ch being chased down by a certain dinosaur. Now, this dinosaur is confirmed to be an Atrociraptor, um, which is the new uh, type of smaller carnivore that we have, as well as some extra stuff, which we're going to get into in a second. Um, so, I guess we should probably read out the uh, description of this scene here. Uh, okay, so we've got uh, so this is what it says on the Empire site. So, elaborating on the image in Empire's new issue, Trevor explains it's a sequence set in Malta, and the, and the picture speaks for itself. It's Chris Pratt being chased by an Atrociraptor, and if they catch up, he's going to die. I can tell you that. Must go faster. Well, he's not going to die because he's a main character. <laughs> so, that's a lie. But still, this is very cool. Um, so it is set in Malta, and it's in that whole Malta scene, um, and it is an Atrociraptor because we also saw these set images uh, a long time ago with the Atrociraptor heads, and um, yeah, they look, they look, do look very good. Originally, I think it was supposed to be a Deinonychus, but that's been changed, so it's now an Atrociraptor, which I, th I think it's quite unique, it's quite cool. And as we scroll further down on the uh, Empire website um this is what else it says if the regular raptors smarts were the thing that made them so terrifying their cousins here have an additional boisterness that makes them a formidable foe where the velociraptor is a little bit more of a stealth hunter this the atrociraptors are a bit more brutish like trevor explains these things will just come at you, and in particular case, they've. Oh, and this, and in this particular case, they've picked his scent, and they're not going to stop until he's dead. They're pretty brutal. They're pretty vicious. So that's what Trevor says. So they're very, very brutal, and a lot more bulky. They do, they do. To be fair, they look very bulky, um, in the image. Which, uh, they do look a lot, a little bit bigger than the Velociraptors. Uh, but then it goes on to say this, not at all. The film will also introduce Pyroraptors among a plethora of other new species. And yes, the director does pick favourites. He said, uh, I love Pyroraptors, I love the Atrociraptors, she, uh, he says. There's a little one called the Moros Intrepidus, which who does not do a ton in the movie, but whenever it shows up, I always love it. So that is also linking back to the um, scene in the prologue we saw for Dominion, uh, where we see the Moros biting a couple bits of meat out of the Giga's teeth before the Giga wakes up. That little feathered dino is the Moros Intrepidus, and confirming also the Pyroraptor, and I will throw up on screen a picture of the uh, Pyroraptor's design here. It does look very good. Um, so it's cool to have two, three, technically, small, brand new carnivores to the uh, whole franchise, really. And not even that, there's also Oviraptor as well, which is technically an omnivore. Or, sorry, it, it, the one that eats eggs. It's an egg thief. So there you go. But, um, what do you guys think about this? So this whole Malta scene... I reckon it's going to take up about probably 20 minutes to half an hour of the movie, I'd say. Or i say 15 to 20 minutes, maybe. Let me know what you guys think of this Atrociraptor um, screenshot that we have. Um, first of all, do you think it's a good screenshot? I do. I think it looks very cool. It looks like a very quick-paced scene. I mean, that's why it's so like blurry. It's very quick-paced quick cut scene so it's literally probably going to be Chris Pratt going around the corner of that doorway that the Atrociraptor is coming through and then it's going to be um, ch 
Chris is obviously going to be going down the stairs, followed by the Atrociraptor that's obviously going to skid and hit the wall, maybe, and then follow him down the stairs. I think that's what's happening here. Um, but yeah, guys, so that is everything uh, so far that has been uh, mentioned that's brand new. Um, like I said, I will keep updating um, every bit of news we get, every bit of information, every screenshot we get for Dress Squad Dominion. Um, but that is all. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Please give the video a like if you didn't like it. And if you did like it, sorry. And also, uh, I've gone, I'm still at 84 subscribers. So if you could subscribe, if you're not subscribed, that would be great. Um, but that is it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. It's been George, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers, much love as always, and bye-bye.